Hello everyone, welcome back to Sim Airport. Alright, so we discovered in the last episode that we have a little bit of an issue with security. And there was a comment and suggestion made on the last video. And I believe it's from one of the developers, uh, or someone who does play around with the game a lot, but I'm pretty sure it's one of the developers. Um, so I do appreciate the advice, and I think we're going to go ahead and take that advice. Um, I'm really always looking for new and creative ways of doing something, and I really like this idea, so we're going to go ahead and implement it. The suggestion was to go ahead and add in a second floor just right on top of the security area to expand it, shorten the queues, and then add stairways to go up to there, and then add a stairway coming down. I think that's great. I think it's an awesome, awesome idea. And without us having any loans right now, all the money that we're pulling in, we're keeping. I mean, it's it's our money, right? So why don't we go ahead and we'll take the queue, we'll shrink this queue down, especially now that we're done with, uh, with people. Um, let's take this queue down to there. Actually, let's just go ahead and get rid of it completely. And I'm going to take this to here. Yeah, so the queue is going to go like that. Okay, so we'll take this ID check stand, assign it to here. This this ID check stand, assign it to there. Okay, so those are both assigned to there. That one's assigned to there. Leaves a pretty big opening over here. Okay. And with that opening, I actually want to take that and expand it out to there just to do that. I'm thinking maybe I put something there, but I'm not sure yet. Uh, anyway, so we've got, uh, we actually have $56,000 available to us. Okay. I would like to take a stairway and we'll go stairway up. And that's going to go, let's go ahead and put it here. And I have this designed, no, 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 cancel, cancel, cancel. So stairway up, I actually want this to go here, uh, here. This is, this is where I want it to go. Now, like I, like I was trying to say, I have this uh, set up to where you can see the little area around it, right? So that is basically stating that it's going to go ahead and build, um, the level up. Oh no, already. Ooh. Ooh, small issue about going up with it. <laughs> oh, I totally forgot about that. I'm, I'm going to go down instead. I'm not going to go up. Can I cancel that? Can I cancel? I cannot cancel the part. Dang it. We're going to have to go down. Instead of going up, we're going to have to go down. I'm going to have to dismantle this. Y'all are going to have to get out of my way. Dismantle. Dang it. That... What is happening? There we go. God. Um, let's demolish that. Actually, just demolish the whole thing. Oh, I can't believe I totally forgot that this was up here. Okay. So instead of that, why are my cues still? Okay. So instead of going up, I'm going to need to go down. So build a, build the staircase going down. So stairway down. Okay, so we could go like that. If we go down, then let's, oh, let's plan this out here. Let's go cyan, let's go up. Security zone is here, so go down. And then I'm going to need a wall here, go down. The staircase going up. S T A I R stair up is gonna need to go. Well, I'm gonna need to build a foundation. But okay, so this actually gives me a good indication though. This needs to go four out that way. Yes. Yes, because then the stairway will go here, okay, and then that will come down here, so the wall will be there, okay. 
Uh, the people are going to come out here. I'll leave it at just the one. I should... Eh, you know what I should have done? Probably should have moved that back. Well, no, I can't because that's the entrance to that is right there. So that's going to have to stay where it's at. And then this is going to have to go like that. So our foundation is going to have to go in here. And then security zone is in here. Q will be here. Okay, that should work. Uh, the question is, though, how much is this going to cost me? So the foundation itself is $100,000. <laughs> oh, my God. Seriously? Screw it. I'm just, I'm doing it. I can go, I can go negative for a reason, so we're just going to do it. There's not much else I can do. I mean, yeah, you could sit here, you know, if you're not playing in sandbox mode, you could just sit here and let the money accumulate and everything. I ain't got time for that. I don't. I do not have time for that at all. So we'll get all this constructed. Uh, we'll go ahead and get the stairs put in here. And then, really, it, this is going to end up being pretty much the exact same. Um, if I can keep, if I can remember which way is which here. So... You there, you there, and that there. And then these are going to go one there, there, and there. And then the cues will go however I decide to put them. Um, I could actually probably put these back one. And that way I can make the queue just a little bit longer, probably. The, ooh, the stairway going up. Well, yeah, that's fine. I, I think I can get rid of... Let's go ahead and get rid of the door. I don't necessarily need that extra door right there. So let's put uh, let's put a wall in there. Dismantle that door. And I need to get... Come on. I need to get that piece of wall in there. Seriously, what is taking you so long to do this? Good lord. Okay. So, security zone is going to go there. Um, I'm going to need bag scanner. Going that way. One, two, and three. Metal detector. One, two, and three. Um, question. Staff-wise, security. I do need nine. Okay. So, I'll need another nine. That'll be a total of 18. I'm actually not doing too bad on money here. I'm actually, I'm making it back pretty quickly. So one, two, and three. And then my cues. It's very interesting at how it does that. Um, if I take this one to, say, here. Oh, um. Let's leave that one there. Let's take this one up. Oh, and around. Um, construction, dismantle that. Get rid of all the planning. Oh, shoot. Um, construction wall here. Okay. Oh, let's see. Dismantle this. And then this queue, we'll go ahead and expand it out this way. And I think we'll leave it there. All right, that works. That will be assigned to that one. That one can be assigned to this one. And then this one can be assigned to that one. All right. Um, I am, like, I'm hitting the total wrong buttons here. <laughs> Seriously, this is ridiculous. Okay, so now we can go back to this one and assign to, and we can make that first class only like we had before. And then I need to get a stairway in here. Stairway up. And stairway up. There we go. So that takes care of that, I guess. Since this, even though the stairway isn't built, uh, people are, you know, going in there. Why, why is this like that? Why is this doing this? There. Go away. 
Stop it. Stop. There we go. Okay, so that should help with um, some of the st some of the issues that we're having, right? People are going to go down here. They're saying they're going to go there. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. So we're good there. Now, I think the last thing that I need to do is I need to get a, a small, like, baggage area taken care of. Um, baggage claim in itself does need to be expanded out. I think what I'll do is I'll take the fence, and I am now to the point where I kind of don't care about money. <laughs> <laughs> like, I just want to sit here and build the airport, okay? I'm, I've been trying to keep it a positive balance, but now I don't care so much. So let's take that and go to about there. Once that gets built, I can dismantle this part right here. I will create a... So we'll leave the hallway here, um, and then we'll move baggage... Well, we'll open baggage claim up. Uh, someone mentioned about moving the pickup area and the drop-off area. Apparently I had moved the drop-off area, but forgot about the pickup area. So let's get rid of the pickup area there. We're going to leave... Okay, first, we're also going to get rid of the garbage zone from there. <laughs> I hate the garbage zone right there. Hate it. <sighs> let's do our pickup area. Let's go one... Uh, six and four. Six and four. Okay. And we'll do a sidewalk. Sidewalk will go out and then into there. Just like we have the drop-off area. Okay. And then these guys are working on that. Security is working well. It is. Is there a way to turn off my... Oh, I need a garbage zone. Duh. Uh, go up. Forgot. Uh, let's put my garbage zone down here. Okay. So that takes care of that. <laughs> kind of like having a little security area down here. Makes it nice. Alright, let's go ahead and add in... Let's say uh, we'll add in the rest of this up here. So foundation... Add the rest of these offices in here. There we go. Okay. I mean, grant wise, I I guess we could, you know, kind of um kind of let the game run a little, but I mean, it's not really gonna do much of anything. I wish I knew what day I was on. Pretty sure we started at day 18, so we still have like three days to go. Yeah, yeah, that's right, because I needed to be on day 25 in order to get that. Um, so we'll get that built. And okay, so now we have baggage claim. Let's dismantle the fence. Go into planning. Now, currently... I mean, I guess I didn't really need to make it that big. So I think I might want to make it this big. I need to have... I'm going to say I'm going to have three of these. You know, one for each gate, right? Um, if I go... It's three by five, I think, is how big these things need to be. Three by five and three by five. If I skip two... So one, two, and then three by five. And then skip to 3 by 5 So then that means my wall needs to go to at least, if I leave two in between... Okay, so the wall actually does need to go... The wall needs to go here, which is then going to mess with the fence. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is a pain. Okay, give me... Let's go construction, let's go foundation put the foundation here that way I can delete this part of the fence and it only connect up to the wall here and then all of this will need to shift over so we'll go so one two 
and then three by five. Sorry, that needs to go here. Like that, okay? So that that's kind of more in the center. And then three by five, skip to three by five. All right, we'll demolish the fence to that point. And then we'll add a foundation into here and there. So then that'll give me three carousels for the bags. And then I pretty much already have the groundwork laid for how this stuff is going to go. Um, let's see if we go into, is it utilities and then conveyor down transit? Yeah. So then I want this to go there. This is just about done. So we have, oh, well, oh, wait, what? Wait, what? Hold on. Hold on. Baggage carousel, same level. Connects to same level conveyor system for automated baggage solution. Oh my god. Oh, now that's cool. Look at that. So you don't have to worry about where the stuff is going to go anymore. You can actually just do that. You can do a baggage carousel from above. Requires foundation on floor below. What? What? That's like a total game changer right there. Huh. So you could actually do it to where... You, you can actually have this to where this is going to be like here and then your bags will just come in from like a wall behind. That is cool. Or you can do it to where so you can take your conveyor transition up. Requires indoor area and requires foundation on floor below. So I could do something like this to where it goes up to the next floor and then it weaves through like the airport and stuff. Oh, my God. That is cool. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, so there's like a whole new planning aspect here of this game. Jeez. So it is it is no longer like two-dimensional at all. You have... So there's there's a floor that goes up to here and a third floor. And then you go down negative two floor. God, there's so many floors now. Wow. Oh, okay. So for something like this then, so for this teeny tiny airport here, I could do, so baggage depot, blue endpoint is outbound only, pink is inbound only, destination only, baggage does not pass from pink to blue, okay. Outdoor endpoint used requires an adjacent taxiway, which is fine. Um, but I'm guessing, okay, so this will still have to go underneath the taxiway itself. Okay, interesting. But, but you could have it go... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. This is like, this is totally blowing my mind. I'm really going to have to play around with this. Um, okay. So since I've got this here, let's take this. Obviously, I'm going to end up doing this the old way. Um, but this can go, I don't know, here, I guess. All right. So that's a, uh, that's a consumer and that's a producer. Okay. That works for me. Which means that this, oh my god, this is going to be cool. So I can actually take, um, where's my baggage hub? So the baggage hub, oh my god, it actually builds the foundation for you too. Sorry, I'm like super uber excited right now. <laughs> um, 
Okay, so I want this is this is awesome. So I want this to go straight out to say here like this, right? Yeah. So I want that to go about. Well, do I want it to go there? Yeah, that would actually be okay. That would be okay. So let's have this go here. And then we'll have a two-way conveyor system. Is this just going to allow me to go? No. But I can just do it like that. Ha! Nice. It just builds the foundation around it. That's awesome. That's totally awesome. All right, so that'll need to be for another hub. I'll need to do... That'll need to be changed to a producer. So that's consumer. Conveyor comes down here this way. See, and that's, that's the problem with the, uh, the conveyors and everything, is that it costs a lot of money to do these. It really does. Now, even, even when, like, you're on this, uh this up here like you still it still has to be within a foundation right so it's still costing you it is it is still costing you i could do so a conveyor up transition this is going to need to go let's say Oh, I know what I can do here. Oh, this is going to be great. Okay, okay, okay. Um, so I can do something like... So let's dismantle all of this first. Let's get rid of that. And then in utilities... So same level baggage carousel... I can put one, two, three. I could do that. Once they get this cleared out of here. So what I'm thinking is I do one, two, three. And then I have the wall going in between all of these. Or I have the wall going down this way. And then this coming down this way into a baggage hub. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we put it into the baggage hub. What are we what are we waiting on here? Oh god, these guys are gonna be a while. Ha! These guys are totally gonna be a while. Okay, well, I guess I can let them finish doing what they're doing. Um, what if I go with let's go up a level? Nope, up a level, not down a level. Um Yeah, I'll let them keep going. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so we have gotten at least this part taken care of. This part is now built. Um, I've got a little bit more work to do, but um, I wanted to make sure that I was uh, really kind of getting this done. And I did a couple of other things, too, while, <laughs> while they were building that, right? So I went ahead and put in the baggage carousels in here. And these are the ones that hook directly up on the same level. So what I want to do is with this one, um, this conveyor endpoint, we're going to change to a producer. That's already a producer. This is going to be a hub. To, no, this is going to be a producer. And I think we'll leave the hub to hub here. Yeah. So then what I'll do is let's go back into utilities. Let's do a conveyor into say that one uh we'll dismantle that i'll dismantle well i can't dismantle that yet um i'll take this conveyor and go into here this one will come down to here as well um not entirely sure how feasible this is really going to be this is just kind of a rough idea of what i'm going to do i think honestly i think uh i did this a little wrong um I did. I totally did this wrong. Hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. 
dismantle all of this. Like this is this is totally not right. This this needs to be canceled, which I can't cancel right now. Um, so dismantle this. Okay, so we're gonna do this a completely different way. These actually need to go in this direction instead of the other direction. So let's see. Let's clear that out. Learning here. Totally learning. Like I'm I'm not a noob at this or anything, but uh, I mean you'd think I would be. Um, not dismantle or not demolish. I want to dismantle. Thank you. Um, or make this a little bit more feasible in the sense of um, these need to go this way. <laughs> like I said, they got to go this way. So if I do if I do one here and I do one there. Oh, and then I just do one there. Oh, that's totally fine. That totally works. Um, this is not lined up then. So I need to dis what upgrade? Oh, booster panels. That's right. So dismantle this, and then let's see utilities, baggage hub. So this actually needs to go here. So I need to extend that out too. So construction foundation, extend that out that way, like that. Uh, dismantle that. Get rid of that because it's in my way. Then I think this can actually be condensed down as well. Uh, dismantle that. So I'm not entirely sure how this is completely going to go. I might just, what I might do is I might just put the, um, the walls back up here once I'm done with this. Okay. So this will go here like that and then we'll do this is going to change to a producer we'll have that conveyor go to there that'll change to a producer that already is a producer right okay so this will go here and then down so i need to go one more out on the foundation and then we'll get rid of that wall this needs to go three more out on the foundation Oops. Okay. Um, I can dismantle the fence that is currently here. I can dismantle that wall that is there. I can then go with the conveyor belt. Almost I can go with the conveyor belt. I'm going to wait for the rest of this stuff to get around here. Um, I think we'll leave the hub to hub here at this one. See the two way conveyor. If I go down one, that should come straight out this way. Actually, hold on. Hold on. No, 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 no. Cancel project. Uh, two way conveyor. I'm going to have come all the way down to about here. We'll go transition up. Right. Yeah. We'll transition up, say here. Dismantle that. That is going to be a hub to hub. That can go... Maybe. That can go there. Okay. Okay, so that's where this is going to come out is right up here. And then I want a conveyor belt to go... To there. So I want that to go like that. So it doesn't actually lay the conveyor belt down when you do that. It just gives you the wall itself of what's going to happen with it. Okay. You actually have to go back through and put the wall down or put the actual conveyor down. Kind of a pain in the butt. I wish it would actually put the conveyor down itself for you, but it does not do that. All right. So we'll dismantle all of that. We'll do our two-way conveyor coming this way. And then the same rule applies is that, you know, you can't have conveyors running next to each other. Um, you can have them go over each other, but not completely. I totally forgot that this needs to connect up to here. Whoops. <laughs> so this stuff can connect up to here like that. No big deal. Um, we are almost done. I'm so glad that we're getting the baggage system in here now. Going in and redesigning this is going to be a bit of a challenge, I think. 
Um, when we go to expand the airport, I think expanding it maybe just out this way, out to the right and down um, are going to be our best options. You know, because we'll have our small teeny tiny airport that we started out with uh, and then we'll just expand from there. Or, or we could go through and just completely dismantle the entire thing and start over, like sell it and start over. But um, I don't know. I'm not entirely sure what I want to do yet. So let's dismantle that, this and that. Like I was trying to go based off the grants here, which actually I think we finished one. Uh, build, we should have. Yeah, we did. We finished that grant. Okay, good. So technically, technically I could take a loan right now just to make sure that, you know, we have money so that we're not negative. And I'm really not that far negative. I'm only $200,000 negative. And we could make that money back pretty darn quick, I think. So let's do hub to hub to there. Like, oops, like that. Okay. And then is, is all of this hooked? Oops, nope, that's not hooked up. Conveyor belt there. Conveyor... Why? Ah, uh, shoot. Oh, that's why, because I've got the wrong belt here. Dang it. I didn't mean for that to be a hub to hub. That actually needs to be a consumer coming from up here. Man, totally forgot about that. Come on. My bad. All right, so consumer, that's better. So you're going to go here. That that threw me off. That just means that it can go either way. Okay, now I can place that there. And then I can place this conveyor going there. Um, <laughs> let's, uh, let's take the baggage claim zone. Let's go zoning none through here. And then baggage claim can be through there. Okay. And then I can take, let's see, construction, wall, and then I want a wall. That's not going to go through a wall, is it? No, that's not possible. Yeah, see, that's, <laughs> um, I think that's a bit of an oops. That's, that's definitely a bit of an oops. Um, <laughs> but what would be cool, though, and I don't, I don't know if that's an option or not, but what would be cool. What would be cool is that you could leave it, I'm going to pause this, you could leave it like this and then have a transition going through a wall. That way you don't have to completely dismantle the wall. That's an idea. I'm just saying. All right, let's go down. All of this should be hooked up now. We should be completely hooked up and rolling with this. All right, so people are coming up to the counter. Nothing's happening. Do we not have bag animation again anymore? Did they get rid of it? Oh, oh come on. Are you serious? Hang on a second. All right, so that dismantled the, um, the actual conveyor, too. So <laughs> let's get the conveyors actually put back on there. Ah, frustrating. Oh, it's all right. It's okay. It'll be fine. Okay, that's done. <laughs> Let's see. They've picked up the bags. Do we have, is the system working now? Oh, no, because I haven't assigned it yet. We have to assign that to each of these. Oh, oh, duh, duh. Like, I'm, I'm totally, like, losing my mind here. Um, let's do a medium hanger. I'm complete. I'm forgetting, like, all of the essentials here for doing a baggage hub, for crying out loud. Like, I've done this so many times now. So many times. All right, so we'll get that in there. Okay, so the bags are moving. The bags are moving. Oh, finally. Finally, finally. Now I don't have to have the guys worrying about, you know, being on the golf carts and everything else and doing all that. So we are good. Now we just need to finish building the hangar, assigning the vehicles, and we're good to go.
we are good to go. So we've expanded on security. We've got the baggage system in here now. That is awesome. Let's go ahead and add a baggage car. Actually, we'll add two baggage cars. I don't think we're going to need any more than two at a time. Ports and overlays. Nah. I think we're okay. I think this is really interesting that we can have it up here on the on the uh, on the ground level. You know, that was something that I don't think that we could do before. No, we couldn't. We couldn't. It was restricted to the lower levels only. So I like this new option. I do. I really like this new option. That is neat. That is really, really neat. So thank you for adding that in. I really do appreciate that. That's awesome. So here come the bags. Here they go to the center. People are getting the bags and we're good to go. Perfect. All right. Well, questions, comments, concerns, you know what to do. Put it in the comment section down below. I believe this episode may have ran a little bit longer than what I wanted to, but that's all right. It's what happens when you deal with baggage and expansion and we... <laughs> Oh God, I'm choking. I'm choking. Um, that's that's kind of what happens when you uh, deal with, you know, two things at, at once here. But I'm glad we got security expanded. Do we have a perfect ops bonus happening right now? Um, cash flow, perfect ops. Oh my God, we do. Since we've added that security in there, like we're getting 18,000. We got $18,000 yesterday. That is awesome. That's what, one, two, three, four, five, six, that's seven days in a row that we've had a perfect ops bonus. I love it. We've made $51,000 today. We're well on our way to getting out of the hole very easily. And then grant-wise, I mean, we completed the one grant, which is good. Um, wait 20 days, have an airport open for at least 15 days. I could do that one, but that's $250,000. I don't want to go that far in the hole. Um, we might end up doing first class lounges in the next episode. I don't know yet. I don't know. Tell me what you guys think of this so far. I think we might we might start going in and um, probably expand on some of our offices that are up here, hiring in some more executives and getting that put in here. Um, and then like we can have an office here, an office there. And then like the CEO could probably be like up another level, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. We could do something like that. Have, you know, tiered a good tier of a of a thing happening here. So we can have our basic operations happening over here at the small airport. And then when we're ready to expand, we expand over to here and we just make it that much bigger. Right. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. All right. Anyway, that is all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching, everyone, and I'll see you next time.